Smell-O-Vision, we need Smell-O-Vision here because I'm surrounded by delicious scents and the aromatherapy is having a very calming and soothing effect on me. It really is. Winter blues turn your bathroom into a place to unwind and relax, and a good place is the bathtub. But there's some do's and don'ts about what you should have in your bathroom, what you should have uh, to help you feel better. Joining us with some tips and other suggestions for relaxation, Mashaya Vaughn, open Sunday. Several locations in Calgary here, Mashaya, yes. as well as in Vancouver. You're yes. everywhere. Yes. You and your lovely scents are everywhere, <laughs> and you are the uh, purveyor of knowledge of all things to do with the bath, like don't have a bath when you're full. Yeah. Do not have a bath when you're full. It uh, could make you feel sick and weigh wow. you down. It's the same as swimming, so. Okay. Yeah. And don't have a super hot or a super cold. Don't have a super hot uh, bath. Um, it can age your skin and it loses the elasticity as well a cold. So you want to kind of keep it at a neutral, warm. Nice, warm is fine. Bubbly. Now you know all this because yeah. you are, uh, you researched before you went into business with yes. your store Open Sundays and these are some of the things that not only do they look and smell delicious but these are therapeutic. Absolutely. And and that's the whole idea. If you're going to have a bath, mm -hmm. it is not to get clean. No. The shower is for the cleansing. <laughs> the bath. This is to spoil yourself. It's for the relaxation. Yes. So, and we were talking about even, you know, some of this stuff uh, can help with your lightheadedness. If you're feeling, because a lot of the times uh, people take baths, they feel lightheaded uh, because of the heat uh -huh. in the tub. The salt actually helps to take that away. Um, as well, it's really good for sore muscles. So after a strenuous workout, the Dead Sea salt um, is extremely conditioning for the skin. And what are some of our options for putting in our bath? Oh, let's start out okay. of the bath. Let's start with the candle. Let's, okay. That's yeah, you have to create in the, bathroom, the mood. Create yeah. the environment. You definitely have to create the mood. Make your bathroom a spa because um, you do spend quite a bit of time there. You start your mornings there. Mm -hmm. You end your evenings there. And it's just you need to have, you got to create the mood. Uh, the reason I started uh, my company with the pastels is because the colors are extremely soothing. Yellow promotes, um, the pastel yellow promotes happiness. Um, the blues has a calming effect and it brings down the heat in the tub if you're feeling like it's too warm. Really? You're actually your eye plays a trick on you and this is my cupcake bubble bath. You know I'm thinking that you brought me a cupcake but you didn't. You brought no. me something from my bath. <laughs> Isn't that funny? So, yeah. uh, so think about the mood you want to create. Right. If your bathroom, you know, in the morning you want to get up and go, so put mm -hmm. surround yourself with those colors yeah. with that if option. You saw, if you saw my bathroom, you wouldn't. I have huge cylinders and it's covered. I've got the bath bombs, I've got the candles light out, I've got the soak and melt. I have a super stressful life, so the bath is a very important time for me. Okay. Um, yeah. So relax. if we can, if we find some of your products at the various places in Calgary, uh, yes. someone is going to be able to educate us about, Absolutely. oh, this is what you need? Mm -hmm. Well, then clearly you need the pink, yellow, and and blue bath bomb <laughs> because that is going to give you the uh, feeling of you know zipping you up or pepping you up. Just right. tell me quickly what does move mean? What's that going to do? Is that gonna oh, do? that well that <laughs> it's a pastel, so it's going to make you very cherry. It is a cherry color, isn't it's it? Cherry. It makes you. It makes you but happy. The yellow is the happy, happy. Okay. That's the one cherry that... versus happy. Cherry. Okay. And blue your final... is calming. And blue pink is calming. Pink is just, you know, pink is just. Because it's pretty. It's just pretty. And um, don't lay in your bathtub and have a glass of wine. No, uh, wine. It's extremely dehydrating as well. Bathing is. Uh, it it drains the body of its fluids, so it's important to have at least two to three cups of water. I drink a ton of water um, when you're in there. If you want to have your wine. You can, but just just follow it up with some water. Okay, so rehydrate, 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 rehydrate. Even and though you're in the bath, which is water, you have to rehydrate. Yeah. Okay. This as well after the bath. Pile this all over you because it's my body butter and it's delicious. It's got the shea butter. Smell a vision at its best here. Open Sunday, Land and Sea, and Buttercream Bakery in Calgary. In Calgary is where you can find the products. Okay, 9:28. Back in a couple of minutes with news. Thank you. <laughs> a huge anti-war rally is planned for Washington. D